It all started a day before by boarding the Goa Superfast Express from Pune Junction at around 4.30 pm. After an overnight journey, we had reached Kulem at around 7 am. The train was late by around 2.5 hours. This would be the starting point of the trek. We had joined a group Ramblers India from Mumbai for this trek. After collecting our life jackets and stashing away our trekking bags at one of the houses nearby, we started our trek along the railway tracks towards Dood Sagar. After walking for an hour along the railway tracks, we took a left just before Sonalium railway station which brought us to a dirt track. We had a breakfast at one of the houses at Solanium and continued our trek towards Dood Sagar. Three hours into this easy hike, we could finally see Dood Sagar roaring in all its glory. After enjoying for an hour or so, we headed back to Kulem, where we had our lunch. At around 5, we boarded the jeeps which took us to Thambi Surla, where we would be staying at a homestay amidst nature for the night. As it started to get dark, this place was something to experience in person. I got up early before everyone and visited the Thambisurla temple which is nearby. It is an ancient temple with integrate artwork. After having a breakfast, we started our trek to Thambisurla waterfalls. One and a half hour hike through water streams and beautiful forest will bring you to Thambisurla waterfalls. We enjoyed there for a while and then returned back for lunch at the homestay as we had to catch the 4.30 pm express back to Pune from Kulim railway station. Overall both the trails were very easy and had scenic views all along the way. Hope you liked the vlog, do like, comment and subscribe.